Hi, Adam Bazaljet here in Naples, Florida, founder of Scratch Golf Academy. I want to talk about how to increase your swing speed. I'm with someone here who's got a lot of swing speed you'll like to watch, Rob Cusick, teacher and uh, club fitter here at Mediterra. So the first thing I'm going to say, and then we'll let Rob hits three golf balls, is you have to practice speed. Believe me, until you experience it, you'll never be able to duplicate it. So here's a great little drill. Rob's got three balls. He's got a lot of speed, as you'll see. One's going to be at medium speed, one quite a bit, and then the third one, within reason, about as quickly as he can swing. So let's go and let's see how that looks. For Rob, that's fairly smooth. There's more speed. And now in this one, while staying reasonably in balance, this is going to be about top speed. Okay, I hope that was helpful for you to see Rob hit those balls. Believe me, in other sports, they train for speed, and you have to be able to feel the difference between a lot and not so much to duplicate it. Now, I've got a whole free course on creating more speed with all your clubs and some strategies. You can touch here and get that for free. I invite you to do that. Let me give you a couple of other thoughts though as we go. A lot of people accelerate their arms and club prematurely. They feel like they're creating speed. They're not really creating that much speed. The towel's a great image. The towel has to load and snap. That's how you create speed there. It's the same with the golf club. There has to be some elasticity. There has to be some softness to it to create speed. One more thing I wanna say, you're only gonna to get to top speed for a very short amount of your arc. You gotta make sure it's where the ball is. So some practice swings with the driver is a great thing to do. You can hear the loudest part of your swoosh through impact or as you swing, and you want to time that right down there at the bottom. You may be able to hear that on this video. So again, elasticity. We're not trying to create arm speed. And maximum speed right there at the bottom. Do that at different speeds too. Train your timing and you'll have a lot more success. If you like this video, Tap the thumbs up, we'll get you subscribed to the channel, get you more free content. Uh, if you have questions or comments about your swings, put it in the box below, I'll get to that if I can. Again, Scratch Golf Academy has all kinds of material for you, I hope you'll check it out, and I hope this helps you get started to creating more speed.